What's up guys, how you all doing? I'm Paul the Tech Giant and welcome back to the channel where today we're gonna have a little bit of fun because we're gonna unbox and test out this little Henry desktop vacuum cleaner and we're gonna see if Henry sucks or if Henry sucks. Now this was actually purchased for me as a gift from my daughter, but as you can see, you can expect to pay around 15 pounds or even less if you hunt about for one of these. And uh, yeah, it is a real cute looking thing. I'm sure many of you out there will have heard of Henry Hoover's before. And it does say at the top of the box here, the perfect little companion for your desktop. And uh, we get a little look there of the attachments that you get inside. So if we just spin around the box then, and uh, we've got a little illustration there of Henry with his uh, snout on the go on that laptop there. And if we go around to the back, it's a few uh, tips there. So Henry's top tips to a cleaner environment. So it says, angle my vacuum head for a better suction. And uh, we've got an example just there. Use my crevice tool for those hard to reach areas. Keep my filter clean so that I can work at my best. Empty dust and crumbs from my body regularly. Right then, come on then, Henry. Let's get you out of this box and uh, release you into the world and see if you are a good sucker. So, lifting Henry out. You can see nothing else in the box. And there we go, look at his cute little face. How mental does that look? So yeah, looking just like its full size brother. So along with the little face there, we've got Henry stamped on the top and a few wheels. So uh, Henry can be dragged about all over the place. On the top, looks like if we lift that up, yeah, we've got a little uh, handle there as well. So you can carry him around. An on off button, which we'll try out in just a bit. And then if we screw Henry's lid off, there we go. We can see we've got the battery compartment. We'll pop some batteries in there in a minute. And then we've got our accessories. So lifting those out, what do we have? So we've got a uh, long, well, if you want to call it long, long for Henry, I suppose, a uh, suction hose there. A few little different attachments. So uh, there's our sort of main vacuum head. Got our uh, crevice tool and then a couple of different sizes of pipes. So let's uh, construct this together. So uh, put that on there. I think we're uh, put on the main vacuum bit on the bottom. Let's put that on Henry's snout. There we go, that's on. There we go, he's pleased to see you. All right, so taking Henry's lid back off then, and let's uh, pop some batteries in. So what we're gonna do is just unscrew the battery compartment. And as we can see, Henry requires three AA batteries. There's one, two, and three. Pop that cover back on, screw it back down. Let's uh, now put his app back on, and we should be good to go. Right, so let's now press on the on-off button and see if Henry has got any life in him. So push him down just there. Oh, there we go. Fire it into life. Hey, there you go, Henry. And yeah, a little bit of noise come out of him. Not too much. And I just think that thing is absolutely mental, isn't it? Look at it. Now it's uh, put my hand over the end. Can't feel a lot of suction if being totally honest. Let's move that. A uh, little bit, very, very light. But to be honest, I think it's more of a novelty thing. But anyway, what I've just done, I've gone and grabbed the crumb tray from the toaster. And, uh, oh, there we go, I've put a few on the uh, side there already. And I'm gonna sprinkle some on the keyboard as well. And uh, we're gonna put old Henry to the test. As you can see, he's uh, well keen to get started. Probably all that excitement of coming out of the box for the first time. So come on down, Henry, let's uh, turn you on, even though you look like you already are. There we go. So, as it says, angle it a little bit. Uh, I don't know if we're doing a lot here. Oh no, we are picking up a few. It's not got the best suction going. But uh, yeah, we are uh, getting those picked up. Let's uh, change the head. Bring in the keyboard and uh, try on that. There we go. The Mac's going mental here because I'm pressing all the keys. Yeah, if I'm being totally honest, it's uh, not got the best suction there, but it is picking them up. 
seems to push those crumbs around quite a bit though. It's not got a mega suction power. Not as good as its big brother. And uh, let's just finish off clearing up these last few bits. Let's move Henry right now on the desk. There we go. All got a big one there that don't like that. And yeah, it has picked them up, but don't expect miracles with this, uh, little Henry. I think uh, he's more show than go. Right, let's just open Henry up just to see all those bits in there. Yeah, there we go. Obviously all you do is uh, and just tip that out and uh, away you go for another round. Well, there you have it in guys. That was my little unboxing and test of this desktop little Henry Hoover, which I just think looks well cute. Like I said, really not amazing when it comes to doing the job, but you know, I think it just looks the part and uh, yeah, a nice little gift for someone. So anyway, if you have enjoyed today's video and uh, enjoyed the company of Henry, then give us a thumbs up and subscribe if you'd like to see more content like this in the future. So thanks very much for joining us and we'll catch you guys on the next one. Bye for now.